I grew up in the time of the Vietnam War, and uh, my dad was uh, was an ex-Marine, and uh, he he always told me that he went to the school of hard knocks, and uh, he had already planned for me to go in the United States Marine Corps, and uh, I received a scholarship from Texas A&I in 1965, and uh, he says, "No, you're going to the Marine Corps." I said, "Well, I have other plans." So I went to Kingsville, Texas, and. Uh, Played quarterback there for four years and coached there for uh, years of graduate assistant. At that time, I, you know, met Mr. Upshaw, Mr. Dean Upshaw, and uh, just just a leader of, of that football team. And uh, better than that, he was a great man, great individual. He from Robstown, Texas, and uh, he he did so many things for that community in Kingsville and Robstown. So just an outstanding man. And, his values were, were such that uh, I wanted to teach my children the same values that, that Gene Upshaw had. And I remember just when I played in my little bit of time, and, and uh, you know, it's, it's it's a lot more fun out there than people think. Because, like, they wonder, like, I know my girlfriend always asks, like, what are they saying to each other, you think? And I'm like, it's probably not what you expect. It's probably a lot of love shown more than it's, I hate you, and da da da. So, you know, I definitely love it. I think the guys loved it. And, you know, it's a great experience for the guys. In our defensive line room, we talk about loving each other as teammates, and um, you know, I, I think that the Hall of Fame definitely embodies that as well. Just the love for the game, the love for each other, and then the love for your teammate across the on your on your same side.